Let's talk about how to go from being a hobbyist painter to a full-time artist. This is actually a very straightforward process and I find most people are putting the cart before the horse. So let's go ahead and get right to it. The first and most essential thing you need to go from being a hobbyist to making a full-time living from your art is that you need to have a consistent professional level body of work. If you're watching this video and you are wondering how to market yourself, how to start making sales, I want to ask you right now, do you have a body of work that is consistent, where the style is consistent, what your painting is consistent, and it's at a professional level? Yes or no? If the answer is yes and you just don't enjoy marketing, this is the point where I would approach a gallery because the gallery is there to handle the marketing for you and take that off your plate. And if your work really is at the place that you say it is, you should be able to find a gallery that's excited to work with you. Another option if you do want to take on the marketing yourself would be to take a look at a resource like The Abundant Artist and their course, How to Sell Your Art Online, to get started. Now, if your work is not there, if you do not have a consistent body of work that communicates a solid brand and that's at a professional level, we have to get that for you. And in case you're having any doubts, if you actually go to a gallery and you don't have that consistent body of work, they will typically give you that feedback. They will tell you that the work isn't where it needs to be or you aren't producing work that is consistent enough. And that's also the first thing that the coaches over the abundant artist would say. If you don't have a consistent style and a consistent body of work built up already, you really aren't a candidate to get coaching from them or to be in one of their programs. If you're curious about how to actually go about developing that body of work that's consistent, I have several videos on this topic. But the first and most important question is, do you know your style? If you don't have a consistent style, there's no way you're going to expect yourself to have a consistent body of work. Now, if you're curious about how to find out what your unique style is, I have a video that I will link above and in the description for you to check out after you watch this video. And if you want my help finding that style, I have information about my mentorship program also linked in the description. But if you would like to hear a video that is all about how to take your style and turn it into a body of work, make sure to like this video and subscribe because that is what we're going to tackle next week. So if you have specific questions about this, make sure to drop them in the comments so that I can make that a part of next week's video. All right, until next time, happy painting.